and we've got her ready. Three, two, one, and pills as we're off. A uh, yellow, red, not a great start for Adelito. Meanwhile, Dave Smith already going to town here, clearing off the top part of his board, dropping that yellow piece down. And while there's that blue garbage there, that's not necessarily a bad thing, giving him something to work with on the top line of the board. And that might have been a bit of a mistake. We'll see what happens over there on that right side. Looks like maybe uh, Dave Smith setting up for a sweet tee. Uh, Adelito down to 18 and Dave Smith down to 17. Mm. Nice swim move by Dave Smith early on in this level to get to that column one. Then another one to get through column wow. two. Dave Smith yeah. just pulling out all the stops. He knows who he's up against, dropping that sweet tee. And I really like what he has set up on the on the bottom left-hand side of his board, too. Those blue fragments are going to drop down, and it's going to set up the rest of the horizontal clears he needs to get through this level. Out to an early four-virus lead. Absolutely. And when, when you're, you know, you're playing a caliber of somebody like an Adelito... Right or you or somebody like that because i've had to play you competitively you just kind of get that spark in you that you just want to fire things off a little quicker and and be a little bit more aggressive because you know your opponent is going to be playing at that equal level of aggression here as dave smith just down to his last few viruses here looking to maybe set up a horizontal play he is kind of cutting himself off from a uh play on the blue oh no he doesn't he does have that blue on the right side Adelito out at 124 and Dave Smith out at a 128 very very close here uh, as we go into level seven yeah the, the thing is as as also a Tetris player who has played against rollers there's just something to be said about having a moment in time when you are competing against someone who is that good and when you're actually manage, managing to keep up with them for at least for a while, it's it's one of it's one of the greatest thrills you really can have as a competitor. Absolutely. And uh, we're seeing here uh, Dave Smith going to set up a combo here. He's going to drop those yellows down, really splitting that nicely. Uh, he's down to 17 and is going to get a tuck here, going to get this blue piece of garbage to drop down as well, getting that quick double clear and then a double blue taking off more. It is 15 to 13 here as we're just over two minutes. And it, the board's a little bit healthier on Adelito's side, but Dave Smith has some things brewing up here, getting that L, yeah, dropping that yellow red piece down, getting the double yellow. So really quickly getting through everything he can. Dave Smith is going to have an interesting play here. He's sandwiched some uh, yellow garbage out in column six on top of that blue. Yeah, I, I wonder if that hesitation just kind of indicates that he's trying to debate how how to best go about attacking that column six. It looks like now he it, it's now is the time to just simplify matters. He's going to get this nice little drop combo that's going to set up the last clear he needs, and he'll be out first at a three hundred one. Yeah, it's it seems like the end games are are really tilted towards it. Adelito right now for a bit, but the mid game, it's really going to Dave Smith. He's coming up with some really great setups and some almost flawless execution, setting everything up on his board piece by piece. Absolutely. The only bit of the only bit of rough stuff going right now on Dave Smith's level eight is that double red, which he had to just toss aside, didn't have a play for it early on. He'll and having that double red over there is fine. He can knock some things down or get another double red hope for a red blitz. Meanwhile, on Adelito's side, Adelito just making a nice little double clear there and then another double clear. Just a little bit of yellow garbage, and as soon as I call it, it's gone. Dropping down those garbage pieces of garbage and then getting a nice triple clear and getting another red coming off the board as it is 17 to 15 here as we're just south of four minutes. A lot of blues umbrellaing the side of uh, Adelito here. Dave Smith keeping a little bit low overall board elevation. Dave Smith's going to drop this double yellow down, get three viruses off the board. He's down to 10. Adelito down to eight here, four minutes into this first round. Dave Smith is waiting on a yellow red to attack columns. He wanted the yellow red so he could create a drop combo with that. But unfortunately, he's got a traffic signal in column four that's not going to be easy to deal with at this point. Right now, he just needs a uh, looks like that might have been a double flip, but it's not too consequential. But Adelito is already in the level nine at about 430. Yeah, and Dave Smith's actually playing this pretty well. Uh, I like the uh, use of the of the garbage there to get things off. He's out at a 442. Dave Smith not far behind here. It is a six virus advantage for Adelito, but Dave Smith with a quick quad clear trying to knock that margin down a bit. He's going to get a little bit of a double blue here, and he's going to drop it on the right side. 
down to 35 to 25. Those Adelito starting to try to break away here and a double red and Dave Smith's going to drop that down. It's a little bit of drop time that could be costly here, but uh, sometimes those are the place to have is to just get those quick combos. And uh, we're seeing here that it is 28 to 21 here. It is just a seven virus game and looks like Dave Smith is going to have a He's big combo it. set up uh, right in the center of the board. Yeah, he's maybe waiting for a blue yellow so he can complete the the sweet tea. There it is. Into the sweet tea, and he is he's only four viruses behind. It's still a game. Though Adelito's board looks really good right now. Adelito playing a very clean board, but I like this tuck by Dave Smith and that horizontal combo that sets up the garbage just nicely on top. He's down to nine here and now down to seven, seven to five here. We're just south of six minutes now at seven to three. What oh, is going to happen here? But that it. double oh, yellow is going to yeah. sandwich or cement it, not sandwich it. Uh, I may be a little hungry, but it is going to be game <laughs> one to Adelito at a 554. But Dave Smith put up a very, very good run there to keep things close. Absolutely. Dave Smith has had a lot of really clever setups and some excellent swim moves. He did great to keep up with Adelito there. Adelito just got some really good fortune right there at the end of his run, which you which you love to see. And we're going to get things going here for game two. Remember, this is a best of three. We've got one crown to nothing. It takes two crowns to win the match. And players are set up. We're just getting readies now. We have readies. So let's do it here in our chat. DRMC bot going three, two, one, and pills. And yeah, Sergeant Saros noticing new crowns here. And off we go. Six to nine here. 28 viruses kicking things off. And a uh, red yellow, not helpful for Dave Smith says, but a nice opening sequence here for Adelito. It's going to tuck that double yellow underneath and uh, start getting things going. Going to take that horizontal. Good board vision by Adelito. Trying to open up the board. Trying to open up horizontals along the bottom of the board. You can sometimes sneak plays down there. Dave Smith with a double clear. He's going to be down to 23. 23, 21 here is worth the 32nd mark. Looking at Dave's board right now, it's it's not easy to work with. He doesn't have much yellow access, but that, that column six is really the greatest concern right now. You see that underplay with the yellow. Now he has access to that yellow virus, and that's going to help clean things up for him. I'm wondering with that double blue uh, in the middle of Dave Smith's board, if he was trying to... Uh, tuck that down for the double clear and didn't quite get it to go for him. It doesn't really mean anything at this point as he's gotten the uh, garbage off the board with another double blue and he's down to 12, but Adelito absolutely blazing through here. Looking like he may be setting up a uh, platform to get yep. a uh, double horizontal and that's exactly what he's doing. He is now just hoping for blue and it is ketchup and mustard all day long here. The Heinz curse as we like to call it or maybe I like to call it, but out at a minute 14. Dave Smith just needing a double blue and a blue yellow, and he'll be out. And, of course, he, the monkey paw turns. You do get a double. It's just a double yellow. But no matter here is Dave Smith looking for that last blue, and he will be out at the 92nd mark. And it is currently a four-virus lead for Adelito. Yeah, I kind of like the Heinz curse. I might use that later. Bidwell's like sponsorship. Yes. Uh, anyways, <laughs> uh, <laughs> good combo here by Dave Smith. He's going to open up the board on that left side, but the right side's a bit clogged up. He's going to have to take care of that. And he does a little bit uh, getting some red off the uh, column three there. Now getting some more garbage down, a lot of garbage on Dave Smith's board, but a good underclear here, Ooh, dropping like the that. blue. Yeah, setting up a, a potential uh, drop combo. Look there it is. Drop T. Look at that. Like, two-way clear one's a t and one's another clear and it's man that looked really good we love seeing big combos like that especially just when you drop it down to a t that's so difficult to do but these players make it look so easy and it's gotten dave smith back into this it's 11 to 8 here is adelito's a little bit plugged up but uh is going to get this nice combo he's going to be down to four viruses dave smith responding with his own though down to nine here it's looking like dave smith needs some yellow help perhaps 
Uh, gonna, curious to see if he tries to go horizontal in that uh, third row blue. Uh, Adelito's going to have to combo out here to get that last red. This might buy Dave Smith some time that he needs. He is going to get that L, yeah, and he's mm -hmm. just going to need the last one out at three minutes. Out at 3.01, these players one Ooh. second apart going into eight. Dave hanging in there. I think he put that upside down, that first pill he dropped, but it's actually set him up for a no-drop double clear in the middle of his board, which he's not getting just because he didn't quite get the right pill to do it. But Dave, very oh, oh. oh I think that went backwards as well. Mm, yeah. Dave, getting a little, little bit flustered. It's how you recover from errors like this. And, oh, looks like possibly another error here. A <laughs> uh, little unforced error as it is 31 to 24 here. Dave Smith's going to have to work on this board. I like the strategy. He's going to get the virus, uh, the blue virus horizontally. Maybe uh, hoping for a double red and can drop that stack of blue down and get a nice quad clear. He's elected to just forego it and clear out viruses or clear out the garbage rather. And just this this blue yellow little bit of uh, hesitation there. Uh, this has opened up a big lead for Adelito. Adelito at twelve as he gets a uh, nice triple clear here. Really uh, has a spread out board, but has free and clear pretty much everywhere except for that stack of blues. But once he gets that yellow off the board, he will be free and clear. And Adelito dumping the red yellow. Interesting play. Not going for just the quick clears here. And a uh, another clear to a double blue, getting him out at a 426. Absolutely phenomenal eight. Uh, Adelito uh, looking to run away with this one. Yeah, the beginning of this level has really hampered Dave a lot, but some excellent improv to keep himself in the game as much as he can, at least. Right now, yeah. he's just he's still got a lot of red left on his board. And having that, and I was going to say, having a double stack of red uh, is, isn't helping him on that right side. Yeah, I mean, it looks like the red viruses are going to be easily dealt with. I mean, just four red fragments, ideally. It's just, right now, he needs specific pills that are half red, and right now, he's not getting them. All right, looks like he's trying to sort things out and figure out exactly what he needs. This is going to keep him from having to take any garbage. It's really just an avoidance of getting lapped at this point. He does get the double red, so he does need yellow, but Adelito is already more than halfway through his nine, so the end of this eight really has plugged Dave up. Uh, he is going to get into nine at a 535, but he is down 25 viruses right now. He would need more than perfect RNG to get there, but he's already off to a pretty hot start here, uh, really starting to clear some things off the board and uh, setting things up potentially for some more combos, getting an L yeah off the garbage clear, a zero drop clear, setting up the double yellows and a uh, horizontal red dropping down, getting the blues off the board. Really liking this play from Dave. Uh, Adelito's being forced to de-sandwich here, uh, very high up on the board, so that's going to eat some time into Adelito, but Adelito just needing this last blue, and he's going to get it out at a 6-11, taking game two and the match. Yeah, that was a that was a tale of two level eights right there because otherwise Dave was doing a really good job keeping up with Adelito. Uh, 